Alright guys, we are back for another Dokkan Battle video. Now, you know, the 8th the anniversary was very, very busy. Regardless of what people want to say about, you know, quality and a lot of other stuff, there was just so much to do during the 8th anniversary, so I've been a little bit slow about getting to some stuff. I'm gonna, we're going to take Physical Super Vegito into the Red Zone Broly fight. Now, how is this going to go? Do you guys think this is going to go good? Probably not. Uh, I'm going to give it a try. <laughs> I'm... I'm going to give it an honest try. Well, now, we're going to cheat a little bit because we kind of... This guy, he's kind of like an L as things stand. But, like, you don't have to make any changes to him. You just give him one small addition and he becomes, like, a top five unit in the game. If this guy had a scouter, just when he's on rotation, he has a scouter, uh, this guy is probably, like, I... I is that, like an overstatement that he'd be top five in the game I, I don't know like i maybe he probably wouldn't do enough damage and it's still like it, you know there's oh my god he's in slot dude he's in slot seven. Oh my god okay uh, the 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 red zone attempts are back so unfortunately we we're just gonna have to deal with him being in slot seven. Oh good oh, that's great um well this works out pretty good now i believe we don't have a Bond of Master and Disciple category character on this team. So, Piccolo doesn't have his intro up. So, we're, we're going to go with the GT unit in slot one right here. This isn't a particularly great opener. We... Ah, uh, damn. Okay. Well, I, I did bring Senzu, right? Like, the only thing is, Senzu is not going to save us, I guess. Maybe I should have brought Double Weez. Oh, damn, dude. Hi. We're, we're just... We're, we're cooked. I'm using so many characters that could fraud us out so quickly, man. In this bro Broly just doesn't play games, right? Like you could say Broly, you know, damage-wise, he doesn't compete with the Metal Cooler Core and Cell Max in terms of how hard he's hitting. But Broly, oh, that's really good. He's supering right there. Okay, that's very good for us. Um, but Broly doesn't play games, man. With his dodge canceling, his AOE, his double supers. Like, Broly is nasty as hell, dude. This... I, I would probably... I, I would describe this as the trickiest fight, I think. At, at bare minimum, this is the trickiest fight. Um, My dodge builds that you guys know I love to do, they destroy the rest of the game. But obviously, we can't do that to Broly, which makes him significantly more difficult. Um, okay. I, you know, I really... We're going to put Carnival Goku in slot 1 right here, and then just, just give me the most key possible. Yeah, this is this is bad. <laughs> this, we got them together. This is this is pretty bad. Uh, that bro, bro, If Broly supers them in slot 3, they are cooked. That character. Super Saiyan 3 Goku and Super Saiyan 2 Vegeta. It, you, you know what the problem with this team is? is we, do, we have, again, we're running a lot of characters that are fighting to do things. You know, Carnival AGL Goku needs to be hit. This character needs to super attack. The other Goku and Vegeta need the super attack, right? Um, okay, th this works out well, actually. We're, we're, we're just going to kill him. Okay, nice, 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 nice. We just have so many characters that need to, like, super attack and stuff like that. Um, all right, so we get to this. Are you serious? Okay. <laughs> Man, come on, that's not funny. That's not funny. No, that's, that's not cool. Jeez. Piccolo. Oh, yeah. We, have, we have so many characters that need to build up, man. <laughs> we just have so many characters that need to build up. I got to run. A, I, I I mean, I, it is what it is. Like, I got to do what I got to do. I know that this, this is the physical Super Vegito showcase. Yahoo. But, like, uh, you know, we are back in the era of my hands are tied because of red zone, man. Like, my hands are... I am... They're tied shut. Not much I can do, man. It is what it is, right? Like, we, I had to rely on that character right there. Okay. Good news. We got a scouter. So, here's where we could really test out how good physical Super Vegito is. I guess the problem is then we're going to get one-shotted by AoE Broly, but what, I mean, whatever, man. Uh, we'll go ahead and play this animation. I haven't been using Tech Gogeta very often lately. I haven't played this in a while, so we'll do this. Oh, 
悟空でもベジータでもない俺は貴様を倒すものだ Alright, l、um, I suppose the good thing is that, you know, as long as we keep Vegito next to、um, the, you know,、uh, Goku and Vegeta, or, I mean, Carnival LR Goku's got the, the survivability too. We do have a lot, of, we have a lot of characters on this, teams, on this team that have, like, a lot of these, like, like, you, like, different abilities, right? Like, we got the standbys, you know, we got the scouter from Gogeta, we got, like, all these, like, heals and, you know, KO survive mechanics and stuff like that. Carnival Goku should be okay right here. Yeah, he'll, he'll be fine. Now, Super Saiyan 3 Goku and Super Saiyan 2 Vegeta, they're going to be able to really get a little bit better, and we could do this nice. Okay, I, I actually think this is, this is going pretty well. Carnival Goku, yeah, he, he's built up already. Okay, perfect. I mean, that, the thing about the, the Broly fight is designed well for that type of stuff, because Broly, over the entire course of the fight, he just has so much HP. You can't dodge him, which, again, I think dodge is a significant strategy you can use. Um, and then Broly just attacks so much, right? So it's, it's pretty easy to build a lot of these characters up that need to be built up.、Um, all right, so this character, what do they need? We need three supers by them. We need three in order to do their standby. Let's pray they do all three right here. There's one. Nice, yes. Yes. And the GT unit, we, we're, we're, we have. Yeah, yeah, we're good, we're good. Because we have their standby available for us as well, right? We could use their standby. So if Broly chooses not to super us, we're good. If Broly chooses to super us, we'll just revive and slap his asshole inside out with the spirit bomb. We're looking good. Okay, nice. He gave us three. We'll be Tech Gogeta is going to finish us off. Now we're going to move on to AoE Broly.、Um, I guess it is maybe a bit of a negative that we're seven minutes into the Super Vegito vs. Red Zone Broly showcase. And Super Vegito has done nothing, but I mean, unfortunately, he's that type of character, I guess. I mean, <laughs> you know, just, just look at Gogeta's beautiful smile and just let, let's just keep it going, man. Let, let, let's just keep it rocking. All right, so we do have the standby available.、Um, okay, okay, okay. This is good. This is good. We, we could definitely test some things out right here.、Um, we, we have to use the revive. There's no other way around this, right? I mean, this is why AoE Broly can be so nasty. But this should put us in a pretty good position after this. Because the AoE is what's going to kill us, which then means that Broly's going to have a significant cooldown. So we're going to eat. Th th this is why GT, Goku, and Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta are the best unit in the game, by the way. Like, it it's their ability to do exactly this, right? Like, they, they, the amount of weaknesses for the rest of the team they can cover is crazy. Let let's just pop this standby. <laughs> みんなの元気をくれこのままじゃほら死ねねえんだくそー頼むぜカカロット俺にこの俺に力をくれお前らあなあ All right, um, let so remember Super Vegito Does need to go in front of hits to build up, right? So, I mean, let's let's just do this. Let's get Super Vegito right there in slot one. Let's sort of see what he could do. Um, I, we actually could we kill Broly with the spirit bomb here? Maybe because Vegeta is going to be able to super attack first, huh? Super Vegito, he's not taking damage from this Broly. There's even like we're not built up, but he's yeah, there's no way we're taking damage here. We're getting the crits. Yeah, he's under a million damage. I mean, we haven't built up. I mean, Vegito needs to get hit, what, five times to fully build up his attack, too? That's with the huge buff from、uh, Vegeta. All right, now this buff, remember, he gives allies 30% attack and defense with his super attack effects right here. So, no additional, really. Okay.、Um, so, that is going to hit this Vegeta spirit bomb. Vegeta, the damage of the spirit bomb shoots way up if Vegeta super attacks first. And the additional. Oh, damn. Dude, Broly is done. I rarely see this anim. This is rare to see this one. Yeah, dude, this is gonna kill him. Broly's dead. <laughs> oh, this is perfect. This is gonna hit Vegito first, which is gonna give us another hit, which we need. All right, well, v Vegito's already taken a million damage in the video. Great. <laughs> ままだ死ねねえなおめえをやっつけるまではな
Damn, even without the crit, um, I feel like we didn't get very many stacks in with the Goku and Vegeta, right? Like, they didn't super... It's not like they did, like, 10 super attacks. That damage is high from Vegeta double supering. I think Vegito's little attack buff added to the damage, too. That was pretty good. That was great. Uh, that, again, a good showing. That GT Goku and Vegeta, man, they really are just that unit, dude. Like, for real. That Goku and Vegeta, I, I just... If I ever see someone act like they're... Uh, overrated or something like that. I'm slapping you upside your head through the screen, man. Stop. That unit is so good. Um, I, dude, I, I love the scouter, man. It makes it so easy. Like, the scouter it, it's playing the game for us. We're not going to use Orange Piccolo, but I, I guess, do I even need to do their standby here? Probably not. What's their defense at? I mean, we're going to put them in the middle slot, of course, but. 570k okay let let's pop um then we're gonna have that i i think we will we will go standby with them and we could maybe finish broly off with their spirit bomb as well i think yeah this could work pretty good we're gonna use goku's um active of course as well uh get some good damage in right here and the guaranteed crits for the turn That EGL Carnival Goku is a really good release to buff this team for sure. Um he, he, he is nice for this team. I may have actually made an error. I probably should have had Goku. I should have put Goku in slot one first. Then, after Goku went in slot one, then I should have done the standby with uh, Goku and Vegeta. Um, because if I would have done it in that order, I think the rainbow orb changing by Vegeta would have been a little bit more effective, I think, is probably what would have happened. Um, now, Piccolo has had no hits or anything like that. Um, so keep in mind, he, he's a little bit weak right now, Piccolo, and he is kind of, we did kind of just, like, throw him on the team, but, um, Piccolo should still be able to perform pretty well. Um, <clears throat> is this the last turn we have of Goku's guard? I think so, right? I think this is the last turn we have of Carnival Goku's guard, I think. Uh, so I'm gonna want to keep that in mind for next turn, although, I mean, yeah, okay, so he's gonna eat this fine. Uh, Goku, of course... Has, he had guaranteed crits on this turn. Goku is fully built up. We got his active skill off. You know, some pretty good uh, stuff by Goku. Yeah, Goku is very good. Very strong character. Um, and then we... I, I think we're probably going to kill just with the Spirit Bomb. Again, Piccolo... I mean, this is not really a great situation for him right here. And he's not built up at all. Uh, we do want to keep that in mind as well. Like, these are, like, the lowest numbers I've, like, ever seen from this Piccolo. But... He hasn't been hit even once. He didn't have his intro buff up. He hasn't been hit. None of that, right? Yeah, and he's still... Yeah, still still a beast. Orange Piccolo, fantastic character right there. Okay, we have the Scouter, remember? <laughs> oh, really? Well, beautiful. Scouter's still up. We transformed with Gogeta on turn four. We have the Scouter until turn nine. So, I mean, this is about as good as it gets for Vegito. Maybe we should leave Gogeta in slot two here. To give him maximum effectiveness. Yeah, I, I, I think that's what we do for sure. Okay, let's give them this right there. GT, Goku, and Vegeta. Key is so easy for them. I don't have to worry. Yeah, the, 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 this, the, the GT, Goku, and Vegeta, they're just a dream. They're a dream character, literally. They're, that's all. They're a dream character is what that they are. It's perfect in every way, it seems like. Okay. All right, give us um, the damage, the crits, anything you want for us, buddy. 
Yeah, you know, maybe, um, it, oh, he has a scouter, he becomes top five overall. I don't know if that will go that far, but, I mean, Vegito is certainly, his damage is, uh, I mean, it's not the, well, like, it's not the craziest. Not, uh, it, maybe I'm, I, I feel like I'm probably underselling him. I mean, he looks good right here, right? There, hidden potential system addition, we did proc it. Then he gets another right there. Still only, like, he's still building up at this point. At, that's the problem, man. There's just too many characters that need to attack, and they got to stack with supers, and they need to get orbs, and they got to get hit, right? We just have so many characters fighting for all these things, right? So, okay, sure, sure, sure. Um, we should be able to eat this pretty effectively with Tech Gogeta. Again, we have the Scouter up. We know that there's no super attacks from Broly. No super attacks on a turn like this is pretty uncommon, I would say. Now, I don't even... This character hasn't even done five supers yet, I don't think. Um, but I, they're definitely going to be fully built up right here. I don't think we're going to kill Broly. Uh, but we're going to kill him with the Super Spirit Bomb in the next turn. Th th what a clean run. This was a beautiful run right here. Nice and clean. Nice and tight. Just how we like it. Beautiful. Ah, ah, fantastic. Okay, yep, eat that. It's fine. We, again, we don't need any more supers. They're, they're sufficiently built and stuff like that. They're looking good. Um, I guess all we need to do here, so we don't, um, as far as I understand on this rotation, have Goku's guard anymore. But, I mean, we should... Who, who's gonna link up better? That, that's, that's better. We should be able to just kill with the Spirit Bomb. Spirit Bomb will kill. That's fine. Yep, six is the most. Yeah, the, the Super Spirit Bomb is sufficiently charged. Goodbye. No crit, of course, of course, of course, of course. No crit, man. Well, this still was a very, very clean run, though. I mean, we got the KO screen for both 8th Anniversary LRs. Carnival Goku looked good, right? Like, th this was just, you know, firm handshakes and Ws all around in this run. That was definitely a good performance by the 8th Anniversary LRs. And we can see, you know, EGL Carnival Goku, maybe Physical Super Vegito. You know, some of these characters were given easy A's to buff these teams, make it a little bit more runnable, a little bit more effective. I sure wish Super 17 got the same treatment, but, you know, he's an extreme class character. We can't buff his team up. So, let me know what you guys thought of Physical Super Vegito against Red Zone Broly. Bro, it was, you know, very easy. Nice, easy-peasy run. ha <laughs> ha.